13 News Now at Noon starts with breaking news out of Georgia. A federal jury has reached a verdict in the hate crimes trial of the three white men convicted of killing jogger Ahmad Arbery. The jury began deliberations yesterday, and today the jury found all three men guilty on all charges for violating Arbery's civil rights, finding the killing was racially motivated. 13 News Now anchor jo uh, Janet Roach joins us now with more details. Janet. Yeah, Ashley, Travis McMichael, that's the one who fired the gun. His father, Gregory McMichael, a former police officer, and their neighbor, William Roddy Bryan, who recorded the shooting on his cell phone, are all serving life sentences in prison for the death of Arbery. 25-year-old Ahmad Arbery was jogging unarmed in February of 2020 when he was killed. The case sparked national outrage after the cell phone video became public during the trial. Prosecutors showed two dozen text messages and social media posts where Travis McMichael and Brian used racist slurs and made derogatory comments about black people. The FBI wasn't able to access Greg McMichael's phone because it was encrypted. Well, this morning, a jury found all three men guilty on all charges, including violating Arbery's civil rights, attempted kidnapping and several gun charges. Ashley, back to you.